That is a lot of damage reduction, by the way. Rift Solar, I love you. You are best NPC. Praise the sun. You're not taking me. access to that. That's right, yeah, it's straight. It, it, it does lead from where I thought. It's just I didn't have it unlocked. No reason for me to kill these things. Harmless, except for Solaire. For some reason. And instead of actually trying to kill the bug, getting it off his head somehow. I don't know if it will kill him otherwise or what, or if it's he's already gone. Even if you do remove the parasite from him, but like, there's got to be another way. Knock him out. Take it off his head. Dude. Yeah. This 
guy's a pain because of the air. But I rolled that. Yeah. your tail! Oh, come on! Your tail didn't even do anything. It was just there. What the fuck? Oh, that is pure bullshit. <laughs> That's bullshit. His tail fucking hurt me by doing nothing. Did an extra roll or I sure he didn't even do his tail. And, uh, he didn't even do anything with his tail. You can't even call it that. Why do you reference? To be fair, I un I two-handed 
thinking I was one handed. If you want to reference Pokemon, sure, but he didn't even do anything. It just hit me. It just hurt. Can you move your tail? Motherfucker! I rolled back! Why is this guy so annoying? If you didn't have this small ass space and all these branches to roll around and your tail blocking half the fucking ground, I'd be fine. Fine. There's no other way to beat this guy. I, I don't have my humanity anymore to increase my drop chance. There's. One way I can try to consistently beat him, and that's to get him to spam lightning. Or arrow his ass to death. And yay. Like, I can beat this guy without either of those strats. It's just I don't want to freaking keep dying. It's not fun to constantly keep dying and having to run this path. To the point where I'm just going to get careless and impatient. I'm already impatient. Even before having to constantly run the same path over and over again. I'm going to be doing it countless times, even with I... If I didn't make the mistake I did, I would have killed him. I could easily use fucking pyromancy on this guy, but I don't have attunement to equip it. I don't need it, as proven by the fact that I nearly beat him. But if I can... If I can tank this guy, which I will, Trying to run back. I'm gonna run out of Estes at this rate. Uh, okay, tank strats are not wise. I'm just taking far too much on very damage. Especially with that. Uh, yeah, tank strength not nice. Especially with that reach of his. I'm running out of it. 
All right, all right. You're making references for no reason now. Okay, there goes his tail. Yeah, can keep Pokemon I can understand with the tail thing, but where are you coming up with that now? It has nothing to do with anything. You're just making references for no sake. That's not even funny. That's just... This is why I don't like when you do that, because it's it's not. It's dumb. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just getting, I'm getting tired of this. But it's really not. It's just more annoying. And... It's one of my pet peeves, and you know that. That's fine. It, I don't mean to have that annoy me, but it's just one of those things that I just, I hate. I just, And you're not the only person. Everyone who does it that I talk to, whether it's people on my chat or anyone else, it's just like, alright guys. Just one of my pet peeves. I, I, I don't like it. It's it's just not funny to me. I'm irritable. And I get upset easy. I'm sorry. I know I'm annoying. I'll shut up. God damn it! Of course. I am too, don't lie. That's why no one watches me. Stop. No! I don't want to be running. Ugh. But I gotta run at him in order to make it to him in time. Okay, final trick. What does that backswing hit me for? fighting like this because it's time consuming. I was closer. Oh, there we go. That back swing pisses me off. Fine, dodge forward then. I gotta dodge. I gotta dodge in the direction of the back. 
damn it. Do something. Do something. Oops. No, I don't want to equip my weapon. Humanity, that would have been helpful. That was a bit if only I had more homeward bones, that'd be helpful, but I don't. Now I'm going to need to warp out and then back in to get my full Estus back. This run back is atrocious. Give me my 20 Estus. Give me my damn Titanite catch pole, you fuck! I need all my rare weapons. I should look up that just in case to see what I have besides that left. And boss weapons. Drake sword, Dragon King, Great, uh, Dragon King, Great Axe, Priscilla's dagger, Moonlight Great. Ooh, I gotta look at this now. I have the Drake Sword. Okay, Dragon King Great Axe. Wish I can. Dragon King Great Axe. That's from Gaping, right? Priscilla's Dagger. Oh, their tail. Uh, so I have that one. Oh yeah, these are tail cut weapons. I do have Priscilla's tail, I think. How is that a rare weapon? <laughs> I don't know. I don't really consider tail cut weapons rare, considering, I mean, yeah, they're only... There it is. They're at one spot only, but it's not like you're spending all that time trying to farm it. You're, you just got to get lucky with the tail cuts. Moonlight Greatsword and Dragon Greatsword. I have both of those. I mean, the hardest tail for me to cut besides Calamite is definitely Seath. 
Only because you gotta get behind his back at a good time where, you know, when he sh spews his fucking laser beam, and hopefully you're cutting the right spot. Alright, so we need Grave Lord Sword, Dark Hand, I got those. We need Black Knight Sword, Black Knight Great Sword, Black Knight Great Axe, Halberd, and Black Knight Shield. I have all of those, I believe. Black Knight Sword. I'm using the Halberd. There's the Black Knight Great Axe, which I know I definitely farmed them for the chunks in the kiln, so I definitely should have gotten them all. There's that. There's the shield. Sword, great sword, great axe. I have halber, I saw sword, great axe, halber, and shield. I didn't see the great sword, but I'm sure it's in here somewhere. Oh, I. Okay, no, there it is. Uh, Channeler's Trident, which I have, I saw that. Crescent Axe. There it is. Crest Shield, dropped by Oscar, Knight of a Store, and Undead Asylum. Well, I've done that once, so I got the Crescent Shield. Crest Shield, Giant Halberd. Dropped by Sentinel in Daylight on Orlando. Sold by the Blacksmith. Oh, for 5000 Good lord, I can buy that. You know what? I'm going to go buy that. We have Silver Knight Straight Sword, Silver Knight Spear, Silver Knight Shield, Stone. Okay, well, let... No! Why? Please tell me I didn't lose anything just now, because that's... Why? I hope I didn't lose anything. I really hope I didn't lose a damn thing. <laughs> Please don't be that one time where this game decides to corrupt. Why? Alright, Dead Rising 2. I got lucky with what? Rare drops? Some, yes. If that's what you're referencing. Sorry, I was busy looking at all my list of items. I didn't understand what you're saying. I got lucky. If you're talking about the rare drops that I've been calling off, yes, some of them. Yay! Sort of. Alright. Okay, so it saved it. I know it's auto if the tail parts. Kinda. Some of them are very easy to get. I mean, it's it's guaranteed. It's not a luck thing. It's guaranteed if you get the tail. Getting the tail is a different matter. There's two boss tail weapon cuts that are hard to get. Seaths and Calamites. If you're good at it, it's not hard. But with Seaths tail... He's a pain in the ass because he's only got one real move that leaves him open enough to where his tail is down, and you gotta f you gotta cut at a right part. If you don't cut the correct section, it's not gonna come off. And either you end up killing the boss or dying yourself trying to cut his tail off. And trust me, I've almost done it. Uh, no. You cut the tail and you get the weapon immediately.
they're guaranteed. And it's, most boss tail cuts are very easy to get, except for seats and Kelly. And even then, I know how to get them both. It's just whether I'm hitting the right spot is a different matter. I've killed Calamite, definitely trying to get his tail before, and I've died several times trying to fucking get seats. I end up having to quit and reload, just trying so I don't kill him. And I, I got it. Like, Moonlight Greatsword, you can see it right there, and I also have Calamite's Obsidian Greatsword, which his doesn't count, apparently, because he's DLC, but Manus's boss weapon counts. I think, as it's in here. Actually, no, it doesn't. None of the none of the DLC bosses count. All right, because that was that that would make no sense considering none of the DLC the DLC did not add any trophies. So no, that doesn't count. All right. So we Silver Knight Straight Sword. Silver Knight Straight Sword, Silver Knight Spear. These are time consuming farms, so. What I'm going for now has a 2% drop or a 4% drop on what and the specific Titanite that I've been fighting. Silver Knight Spear, Shield. And this is the only Titanite demon that respawns. Like, I farmed a shit ton of the Silver Knights. Like, they're all over in Orlando. I farmed them to no end. I farmed them when I first got to a Norlando on playthrough one, so I made sure to get a good chunk of those. Stone Great Sword. I. Stone Great Shield. <laughs> I actually got lucky with a lot of these drops. I don't know if. I definitely got. This is New Game Plus. So I definitely got them all on first, first New Game. I got, I think, most of them had to have been first new game. I could have been wrong, because when I picked this up again recently, I was already at Quayli, which was over, which is about halfway done. Close to halfway done. Not quite, but it's the second bell, which means you can start to initiate the second half of the game. So I was pretty far into the game already. So I definitely got these on new game plus, or new game, which some of these are pretty rare drops. Even though they are sold, I can easily buy the specific weapons I've been calling off from the blacksmith. Or a good some of them, not all of them, but a good portion of them. Like the Silver Knight stuff I need to farm. And the Titanite pole I need to farm. And the Black Knight stuff I need to farm. But the stone shit and everything else I need to... I need to farm. Or uh, farm for. Stone Gr uh, Grant and Sanctus. Well, I killed... Black Phantom Leroy, so I should have his Sanctus and stuff, and his Grant. There's that. Sanctus is his Miracle cast. A lot. <laughs> How many rare weapons are there? A quite a few. As for how many weapons in total, I have no idea. Oh, it's a shield. Yeah, I have it. Okay. So I have all of that. All I need now is the Titanite catch pole and the other item. There's a lot of weapons in Dark Souls. And if I wasn't the kind of guy who wants every weapon, at least one of every weapon, then you would not you would see a very small inventory. I'm a collector, what can I say? Like, it, PSO really rubbed off on me when it comes to collecting weapons. And PSO's weapon collecting just stems from wanting every rare weapon, not every weapon in general. Because good lord, my inventory space in PSO would be filled up five times over. Oh, I need a saber, I need a gun, I need a brand, I need a fucking rifle. Yeah, okay. My inventory space is filled five times over with the rares that I do have. I 
I try. Alright, let's see. There's Dragon Crest Shield. Havel's Great Shield, which I have. I think. If I don't somehow have Havel's, that'd be funny. I don't think I have Havel's Shield. <laughs> ah, how did I miss that? I know I meant it. Oh, that's funny. I don't have a shield. That's great. Alright, I gotta go get that. <laughs> I have his armor, but I don't have a shield? That's hilarious. Dragon Tooth. That's from Havel. That, that's from him, I think? Or that's probably also in the chest. I don't like it when they split up armor pieces in chests. Somehow I must have missed that one chest that contained them. I passed the dragon dude? There, there, uh, no. Wait, what? Somehow I missed that too? Wow, I got his armor and that's it. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Alright, that's fine. I know where that is. Velka's Rapier. Astora's Great Sword. Straight. Astora's Straight Sword. Blood Shield. Blood Shield, Black Iron, Great Shield, and Effigy Shield. Well, there's that. Blood Shield, Effigy Shield. I should have some of those, please. Oh god, no. I have to go get these, don't I? Well, there's the blood shield. I need the effigy shield? Fuck, it's in the Tomb of the Giants. Oh, there it is. Oh, thank God. All right, so I have to get... I'm already here in Orlando, so I have to go get me Havel's fucking weapon and his shield that I somehow missed, unless I am blind. Good Lord. How did I miss that? I can... I know that's there. Why would I miss it? Whatever. I'll take it, I guess. How is that rare, though? It's in a chest. I mean, I get it. It's a it's character significance. It's... But, like... Define rare to me. People. Rare should be limited to boss weapons and items that you get from an enemy that's only in existence in one part of the game. Or an enemy that is an NPC human character that does not respawn. So just have himself, but he doesn't drop you that. Getting an item in a chest like that shouldn't be considered rare. Or tail cuts, stuff like that. Or rare enemy drops such as what I'm going for. By, uh, I need 10k. Such so as farming the items that I'm about to buy would be considered rare. But I'm buying it, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, giant shield. Oh. I need that armor. I don't have that armor. I need it. I need it. I need it. I need it. All right. So that's done. I'm not farming that because they haven't dropped me no matter how many times I killed them already. Now they're going to start dropping it like mad, though. So now we have to go... I just got to remember which room it was. Oh, yeah. Let's go around. Let's go get Havel's thing. If the Titanite here did respawn, that'd be great. But it doesn't. 
I think they intentionally made the one on the bridge respawn for farming the Titanite pole. I still have the ones in the, the two, I think. Yeah, see, he doesn't respawn. I still have the two that remain in Sen's fortress, but they're not a four times drop. They could have at least made him respawn. Would have been nice. Hello, Silver Knight. And down here is where you find your Havel armor and Havel gear. That I somehow missed most of. Oh, that's a mimic! Why? Oh, I saw the chain last minute. Oh, that scared. That actually scared me. <laughs> I didn't even notice the chain until I opened it. Fuck me. I forgot there's mimics down here. Well, you got to see a great death. That actually scared me, and I know it mi- How did that scare me? It's because I didn't notice the chain until it was already open. Whoops. Whoopsie-daisy. God, I am so easily startled. Hey. I'm getting tired, that's all. Oh, clip that, somebody, please. That's great. If that's worthy clipping. I'm really getting impatient. Like, I am seriously... Like, what was I thinking, not getting handles? I am seriously getting impatient. Like, I didn't even bother to check that chain. I just opened it. I saw a chest and was like, hey, here you go. And nope. Fuck you, Mimic. Also, does the Mimic have not count? Ah! That's definitely a rare drop, but I think it's guaranteed if you manage to kill every Mimic. So there's one Mimic that will drop his head, I think. I'm not sure if it's guaranteed regardless or... Definitely obtainable through mimics only. And one of them can drop it, if not guaranteed after killing all of them. I think that's how three works, if I recall. Which, I'm not sure, do I have, or two or three, one of the two, I'm not sure. But I know I don't think I have it in three. Ah, come on! Come on! Really, dude? Come on, man. Stop. Fucking come on. God damn it! Would you? St uh. to let that mimic kill me. And then I gotta run through all of this. I gotta go down here, wait for my character to land, then get up, then heal, and then wait for her to do the animation. Then I gotta run over here. And then I gotta run, I gotta run, then I gotta run, then I gotta run, then I gotta run, 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 run. Then I gotta go wait for my stamina, then I gotta go down the stairs, then I gotta go over here. I gotta make sure this guy doesn't hit me. And then I gotta run up these stairs, then I gotta replenish my stamina, then I gotta go up these stairs, and then I gotta go over here, I gotta find this doorway, and then I gotta go down these stairs, and then I gotta fucking go in this doorway. 
And then I gotta go down these stairs, and then I gotta fucking make sure this guy doesn't block me, which he did. And then I gotta fight this guy, and then I gotta roll, and then I gotta heal, and then this guy's gonna stab me, and then I gotta fight him, and then I gotta fight him, and now I gotta fight him, and now I gotta fight him, and I'm gonna now I gotta fight him, now I gotta fight him, now I gotta fight him. Then I gotta kill him, then I gotta kill him. Run down the stairs. Uh, go out this door, and then I gotta go kill, hit, hit this guy. And then I gotta roll this way, and then I gotta go heal. And then I gotta take a hit, and then I gotta go in here, and then I gotta go down this stupid thing. <laughs> I only gotta kill that one. And then I gotta go down this stairs, and then I gotta heal. And then I gotta search for fucking chests. Then I gotta open it, then I gotta wait for the animation, I gotta do that, then I gotta pick up that, and then I gotta open this chest, then I gotta go do that. Then I gotta open this chest, and then I gotta grab that. I don't know how I didn't have that somehow. Maybe I did, and I just didn't see it, but I don't know how I missed it. I really, if I have it, I don't know how I would have missed it. Yeah, I didn't, I definitely didn't have that. Don't know how I didn't. Now I gotta lock my shield. Now I gotta go up here, and then I gotta warp out. Then I gotta unequip my shield, and then I gotta warp. I gotta wait, and then I gotta go to the load screen. Okay, that's getting annoying. You can tell I'm being sarcastic at that point. Now I gotta sit at this bonfire, and then I gotta warp, and then I gotta go back to the Then I gotta go back to the Daughter of Chaos. Then I gotta warp. That is exaggerated into what I actually do when it comes to fucking being impatient. All the different animations of things really annoy me. I'm just exaggerating. Yeah, then you gotta kill all the Silver Knights, because if you don't, Havel shit doesn't appear. No, that's not true. Then you gotta go kill Havel himself 50 times back to back without taking a hit. Then you gotta beat the game 20 more times without taking a hit in order for Havel stuff to appear. Facts. I gotta kill this guy, and then I gotta kill that guy, and I gotta breathe, take fire damage, then I gotta kill him. And then... Down this tree, branch. Then I gotta get stuck on that branch. Then I gotta run down these stairs. I gotta move my camera. I gotta run past these bugs. God, why can't there be a cricket path? Why do I have to run past these bugs? It slows me down. Then I gotta wait for them to hop. Then I gotta see that clipping. Oh my god, everything sucks. Then I gotta wait for that load screen for that name to appear. It's not even really a load screen. Then I gotta see his tail moving. Oh my god. <laughs> then I gotta hit him. <clears throat> then I have to hit him like two times. I hate that aftershock.
shit on my face. Shit on my face. Do it. Shit on me. <clears throat> Told you that felt good. Do it again. Shit on me. Shit on me some more. Swipe back. Really fucking sucks, balls. Excuse me? has a fucking attack for attack frame even after it's done its date that's nonsense nonsense i say you have one leg and one job and no head suck my wang Thank you. I really wish you would do that more often instead of swiping. Swiper, please swipe. Fuck, I forgot. His stupid catch pole has an attack frame. Come on, dude, stop! I know it is, and I want it. Ah! He's really not that strong. It's just his his area sucks. He's really not. I mean, they can do a lot of damage. I'm also on New Game Plus, but like to be fair, I also don't have the greatest armor on, and his area is pretty bad. I'm ba I'm pretty good at dodging most of his attacks. Says the guy who took who used up over who used up half my Estus. However. His, uh, his fucking weapon has a frame that it hurts me when it shouldn't. At least I think. Because it's in the ground and done attacking and I run into it. Yeah. Take care, man. Fuck off. Take care, dude. Have a good one. Like, he... I have no problem fighting them. I just... I don't like the area he's in because his tail pretty much blocks... Half of my f half of my movement, a good portion of the time, and I'm afraid to roll off the edge. Oh, trust me, his tail killed me. Even though his tail didn't move, or at least that's what it looked like to me. I wasn't really paying attention. I was in, I was rolling, and his tail did not move, or at least what I thought, and I somehow, and it killed me. Maybe he did attack me with his tail. But again, he doesn't really swing his tail, though. And if he does, then I just... Half the time I'm paying attention to his weapon swipes, and I don't really notice that he really hits me with his tail. His tail can move, but it more or less just traps you. I don't really pay attention to whether or not he actually hits me with it. He actually swings his tail. does, I don't really notice it. 
I am not the most. Uh, well, yeah, but it moves, though. It's not really his tail attacking, though. I, I consider that as... I consider that just his tail moving, though. It shouldn't be a and it shouldn't be an attack. I know it is. I know all about his tail, but it still does not... It's not like he's swinging his tail at me. That's what hit, That's what killed me. I almost had him dead for the first, like, the first run I did of him where I tried to kill him. I almost had him dead. Dodged his attack and his tail got me. When it doesn't even look like it should be in an attack. To be fair, none of the boss weapons are good. And if, not to me, anyway. I don't... I like Quaylag's Fury Sword. That's about it. But I don't... I really don't care about elemental damage, though. None of the boss weapons to me are very good. Damn it. Oh, come on. Come on. Uh, you're breathing fire for far too long. I took far too much damage because you should have ended that fire breath. Hey, black fire. How you doing? I don't like fisting my enemies. Unless you're Ifrit and God, Devil May Cry, and that's a different story. My favorite weapon is Devil May Cry, but that's it. That or Tifa from Final Fantasy VII Remake. She's by far the best character. The only time I don't mind fisting my opponents. I mean, I have used the Fire Gauntlets in Dark Souls 3. I forgot what boss weapon. I think it was the one of the f one of the fire demons that you fight. One of his weapons is a fire weapon. Did I not sit at the bonfire? I sworn I did. Wait, what? Excuse me? This guy did use up half my Astus. I'm not going insane. How come he's not here? I sat at the bonfire, did I not? What? Did the remake fix that? Remaster. No, because that was the second time I killed him. Is this Dark Souls 2 now? I keep forgetting I can just jump down here. I know it's the only one that respawns. It's just the first time I've seen it not respawn. Wow, I mean... To be fair, my game has glitched a bit, and it also kicked me off. Like, it crashed to dashboard, so... My game has not... I noticed some weird 
texture glitch earlier. I can't really explain it, but it was just some shit that appeared on screen. Nothing like maps missing or anything. I've I've had that before, where textures never loaded. That's on my Demon Souls Let's Play. I my Demon Souls Let's Play where texture didn't where a map texture didn't load. There he is. What happened? Sworn I rested. Okay then. I wish he would be bugged and just drop me a weapon. Drop it. Drop it. Hiya. Ow, oh, I hate that splashback. Fucker. Yeah. Okay, I didn't mean to roll that way. I rolled back, even though I should didn't need to. I missed. I rolled. There's a tail swipe. So that I can make sense, but that's not what it looked like when he hit me with his tail at all. And I'm sure it did, but I was paying more attention to his swipe than I did his tail. And it looked like his tail didn't even move. Yeah, I know his tail hits me then, but it's not what it looked like. I just wasn't paying attention to it. I'm sure that's what happened. Thank you. I, I, ran. I did not roll. I ran, game. I was holding circle. I didn't hit it. The fucking hell. And also, I was holding straight. Why does run? Why does rolling straight correspond to rolling? I, this is one thing about Dark Souls I hate. I am holding backwards, I roll forward. I'm holding, I'm running straight, and I'm aiming straight, and I roll to the side. Why? Every time I go to dodge an enemy sometimes, I roll right into them. I hate it. It happens so goddamn often, and I'm rolling backwards, when I'm like in a rolling spam frenzy trying to dodge an enemy because I'm trying to heal, it either do either kills me or it doesn't. A lot of the times I end up surviving it, but I end up rolling into the boss a lot of the time. And I fucking don't like that. It's like, what are you doing? Are you having a dance off over there? Ah. That's the first time in a while since I've rolled off that ledge. I am not dr my character's rolling all sorts of stupid. All I'm doing is trying to hit circle once. Or hold circle, I'm not hitting it. And it's now causing me to fucking roll around like I'm Sonic. Good lord. If only my Dark Souls experience can give me enough for fucking Code Vein. That game has been... was kicking our ass. I mean, that game is Souls-like, but it is a blind playthrough, and at this point, it's harder for me. Until I beat the game once, then it will become easy. But each Souls iteration or Souls-like is going to be vastly different despite having that experience. Trust me, I died countless times going into Dark Souls 2 and 3. Even with all the Souls gameplay I've done in the past, leading up to each new iteration, feels very, very different. Especially the speed changes in the newest ones. Hell, going from 3 to 1 was so drastically different, considering I haven't played 1 in the longest time, going back from having played 3 to 1 made that so much harder. Oh, you mean when you hit right on? I wouldn't. Uh, that's that's meta. Ow. That's me right there. Right there. I'm rolling backwards. Why am I going to the side? I wouldn't. How do you guys figure that out? Like that's all just the same to me. That's meta. That I just don't. I would never understand. I don't pay attention to the damage half the time. I will never notice. Never notice that. I was rolling backwards. Why? But 
that's not sweet spot. That's range. Is that the same thing then? I mean, that doesn't make sense, but that... That... that no. I don't know. I mean, that doesn't really matter to me. Until I play through the game, I may not, I'm not going to be using a great sword in that game. Period. But then, I guess that sucks. stupid if it doesn't, but I just... That's not something I'm good with. You're talking to a guy who doesn't understand that. The, that. It's all the same to me, really. That's stupid. That's not really something that I need to worry about. That's not something that'll piss me off. That branch had nothing against you, dude. Something else. Do you lightning? I know I gotta go further back for it, but you're not even doing it. Damn it. I don't wanna risk fighting you head on, because you're gonna fucking destroy me. Because of this area. Great game so far. At this rate, I might I'm gonna like it more than Dark Souls. That says a lot. Dark Souls is my favorite franchise even now. Favorite franchise, not my favorite game though. What the fuck? <laughs> Nothing will top my fascination for that star. I went right through you, what the hell, Smo? Ah, okay, that was a hell of a counter hit. Ow, that was a hell of a counter hit. I was running when he hit me. Jesus. Ten. I'm gonna get off for the night, guys. My eyes are starting to hurt, and I'm making... I am not... I am getting careless. I'm going to have to fight this guy head on if I want to get this faster. I'm trying to bait him into do his lightning to mitigate the amount of damage and chances of my own death. But it's not going well. And I'm getting impatient and after about two or three times of doing that, I'm just going to say fuck it and try to just fight him normal. And that's just going to cause me to get frustrated and I'm already just tired and it's I haven't had much sleep in the past couple days already so. but tomorrow we'll be back on with more souls more souls 
hopefully I don't become a morsel myself. And we're gonna hopefully finish the rest of the game up to get on to New Game 3. Move my happy ass to... Orange Skin Smoke, because I do want to do the alternate Sif scene. Just to show it off for my stream, because I haven't done that, even though I would have done it this playthrough. But... I needed to fight four kings in order to get Koth. But we still have DLC this playthrough to do. So yeah. We have one more playthrough, full playthrough. Let's raid Spock again with more Phasmo, since he was very generous and very awesome, dude. He's a very awesome dude. Enjoy some ghosts. Go, go Spelunk. Have a good night, guys. Thank y'all for joining, everyone. See y'all tomorrow.